Hi guys, this is our tour of Gladfield Malt. Uh, this is one of their main roasters. Um, I've done some voiceovers on parts of uh, this because the manufacturing noise is so bad, as you'll see in some of the screaking noise towards the end. <laughs> hey, I don't mind diving in there. Gabby might get a bit upset, but I won't. <laughs> yeah, so that obviously we won't uh, touch it uh, as in the malt. That's uh, stock feed. But you know, what is in there, that was full to here. Wow. Yeah, so it's, Right, this is uh, one of their two uh, seeping uh, tanks. Uh, they hold about 70 tonne of grain. Um, they soak them in there, I think also 24 hours. Uh, and then they drain them, which uh, you'll see in a minute. They slowly drain that. Uh, they've got big augers that are sucking it out. And uh, then that goes into the next bit, which is the germination boxes. Hi, hi, this is uh, the first of their two germination boxes. Um, they can hold 70 ton of uh, barley in there for germination. Uh, we've just come from the uh, seeping um, tanks. Yep, and um, so we'll be spent. The barley will be in here for five days to germinate uh, before it goes through to the next process. So, this is all part of uh, what Gladwell's are doing in their upgrade uh, to supply all home brewers with more, more malt. Well, this is Gladfield's uh, warehouse. Um, absolutely huge, as you can see. Big half ton bags where they? over there. American Ale. Uh, that's Shepherd's Delight behind us. And yeah, everywhere you look, malt, malt, malt. It smells gorgeous. Um, wish it was a smell TV because uh, you guys would be salivating. Oh, hi everyone, um, so yeah that was Gladfield's Malt, um, this is my first IPA which has uh, come out absolutely beaut, funnily using all Gladfield's Malt, so um, I thought it was quite good to have that out here tonight. Um, this is my herd of cows, or one of my herds, we've got two herds like this, two herds of 300. Um, yeah, so it's really good to see a business like that, um, Gabby and Doug, um, they've started that business from next to nothing. I think um, uh, Doug's father started, uh, had a grain farm there originally and um, they started only doing like a Pilsen malt and I think it's a pale ale malt they started off with and then I slowly worked the business up until uh, now with this new um, venture that they're doing now they're going to be able to do a 70 tonne of um, malt a day processed uh, in the new system so and, 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 the, and the great thing is the whole thing has been done for their kids it's, um, they're so family orientated, it's uh, lovely to see, you know, um, their kids are going to grow up and they can come into that business, uh, whether it be out in the farm with Doug growing the grain, or in the laboratory, or uh, in the processing plant, or um, right out to even just selling the, the malt uh, to all the customers, so um, I think they've got three kids, so but it's just a really, it's a, they're really, really lovely people to uh, meet, um, Gabby was great showing us around. Um, and it was a really, really good day. So here's a drink to uh, drink to Gladfields, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video.